So I've acquired this 78 Les Paul Custom in, well, it used to be white, I guess. It's really yellow now. Uh, it was all stock. It's got the original T-top pickups in it, which are about 7.4K resistance, and they've got really small magnets, so they are fairly low output. And originally, this guitar came with a 300K part, like all those late 70s Les Pauls do, I think. And I've now changed them to 500k, which in theory should open up the high end a little bit and increase the output. And I thought I'd just compare it for you and do some like before and after clips. Um, I haven't changed anything, like the distance between pickup and strings is all the same, everything's the same, even the strings are the same. So that's the only, I don't want to say problem, but the only difference there, because I put new strings on just before I recorded the 300k clip. And that was about a week ago. So the strings for the 500k clip are about a week older, which should actually decrease the high end a little bit, the bite. Um, but turns out the opposite is the case. So despite the older strings, um, the 500k parts, just like they should in theory, are actually a bit more biting and a bit more open sounding. Um, I hope you can actually hear it in this YouTube clip. If not, um, I've put a link in the description with the zip folder to the DI tracks so you can re amp for yourself, compare them with like Magic or something, and the amp tracks as well. So you can listen to them on your, uh, well, on a better system and not uh, compressed by YouTube or whatever. Um, so yeah, but I think it was a nice change actually, it was an improvement. Um, don't know if it's Audible enough for you on YouTube, but well, let's see, let's find out, huh? Thank you. 